Well, you know what, like in Romeo's Bleeding, I knew what I wanted it to look like, and then uh, I wanted to find a DP, which I did, you know, who, um, very diffused colors, you know, and highlights and stuff, and just look at their stuff and, and uh, you know, but this person is right or wrong for it, you know, and so on Romeo I used uh, Darius Wolski, that was his first movie, and he'd become a major, major cameraman after that, you know. I see he'd done a lot of commercials. Uh, Derek, he, yeah, yeah, he did. He used to do commercials before. He still does, you know, but he did all the Pirates of Caribbean movies, and but I mean, he's incredibly, and I wanted it very dark, and he's, he, the lights, everything very dark, and so it's great like that. But it's that, you know, but it, you, you, it's, it's, and you know, you, then you meet and you talk and you see when you can get on with each other and all that. It's very important. Uh, Do you like a DP to, uh, to sort of give you their own shot list and no. sort of interpret what they think? Uh, no, absolutely not. No, it works the other way around. So I you'd mean, rather give them sort of your... Yeah, but I mean, you explain your shot, suit. you know, and then if he's, he's got suggestion about it then you can accommodate it you know but it, it doesn't know they're there to absolutely service you and uh, it's a big misconception about it you know they say oh, well he's an incredible you know his angles and all that well the angles come from the director you know yeah where you put the composition absolutely you know unless it's somebody is totally on visual and doesn't understand there are directors like that who come from comedy, who are great comedy directors, and but they were never interested about the visuals, you know. But you have to spend this. It's very important to to go through the whole script with the DP and explain how you want to shoot it, how you see it, you know, so he understands, you know. Then uh, they're very strange DPs, you know, because most of the time they don't really read the script, you know. You've encountered that where the Yeah, and then you're working your way, and I said, you know, this is supposed to be night, you know. Oh my God, you know. You know, I mean, it's quite amazing, very famous DPs, you know, they just don't have the patience or the understanding of what it needs. And uh, with, when it comes to rehearsal with actors, um, if you do have the time in pre-production to rehearse, do you prefer that, or would you rather have actors come to the set no, fresh? No, no, just no, 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 not at all. No, you have to work with them. You have to rehearse before you start the movie. If it's a film, I would probably rehearse at least minimum a week, if not two weeks, with them, and then. Um, we have to get inside each other, you know. And if they just come to the set, it, you can't do that. And I mean, as it is, I always go, and I go in the morning early, you know, I go into the makeup room and spend time with them, just talking to them. You know, it's terribly important. And nobody does that. Kind no of gauging where practice. they are. Hmm? The kind of well, yeah, but they adjust it, you know, I mean, because they have to perform those characters, you know. And, and there may be something important to talk about or talk it out. Or do you like to, uh, when you're rehearsing the actors in pre-production rehearsals, do you start planning out where you're going to put the camera and mm. what shots you're going to make and how you're going to stage it? Yeah. Or do you leave that more the staging aspect and the shot aspect when you no, get to no, the you set? To, I mean, you, you go on the set and you rehearse the scene and you're staging it, you know. And you really knock it into shape, you know, until it becomes shootable. And then you, you meanwhile, you just walk in the, you know, you, 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 they, they will know. Because of always, I keep saying, wherever I am, that's where the camera is, you know. Yeah. If I'm filming the two of them, you know, or if I'm behind you, or whatever. Uh, but it, it's, it's very important to. And it's, 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 it's only really for the DP, it's the most important thing, really. So he understands how you see it and where you see it, how you want to shoot it, and what you want out of it, or what shock you're trying to get out of it, or, or shooting the two of you with somebody 
coming behind you with a knife which you don't see but we see and how much of it, what you want to show and all that. Mm -hmm. It's as much to do with it as the script is, you know, of how you visually see that. 